Hi there, Melody Moore here with What You Need to Know. This is a special little episode, shall we say, of a little bit of an experiment that I'm running. Um, the background on this is the goal of being more efficient with how we spend our time as leaders and as CEO and, and people that are trying to get the most value out of our time. We sometimes focus a lot on our team and contractors and different things of like, how are they using their time effectively? But how can you ensure that you're using your time effectively? Because ultimately, you are the highest paid person at your company. I assume at this point in time. So I'm going to walk you through the process that I've been using and, and some holes that I've been seeing on it and then the next iteration of it. And then potentially you can take some stuff from this as well and be able to apply this with the overall goal of am I spending my time on the right things consistently. So currently I use a tool called Sunsama and it allows me to put all of my tasks throughout the day into categories. So you can see here, these are the categories that I, I currently have. I just recently added this one and you'll understand why in just a moment. Um, of I put business development, sales and marketing operation, accounts and client work, and then I have some personal stuff in there to kind of see, okay, hey, where am I spending my time consistently? The thing I love about it is it gives me this lovely breakdown at the end of the week, which says, okay, hey, where did I put most of my time throughout the week? Now, the problem that I found with this is I can be doing business development stuff or team meeting stuff or marketing and sales, but could I have delegated that out? Was that the best use of my time? Was there another way to do that that could have potentially been more valuable than me personally going and doing that? And I, I can't really see that from this. I can see what I was doing. I can't really see the outcome of why maybe I was doing it. So my next iteration is uh, using the, um, I forget the name of it now, I'll put it in the, I'll put it in the notes in this video, but it's a hierarchy of, of grading your tasks between one, two, three, and four. So what I'm going to try this week is putting it as one, two, three, or four, and then putting the different areas of the business within each four, each one of those four categories. Um, because something that is, you know, helping out a team member figure out how to log into WordPress is something I should delegate out. It's not necessarily high value. Whereas working with a team member to up level their skill set of maybe something that could come off my plate is high value. So it's like both of them are team management, but one is high value and one is not. So there's a little bit of a pathway of defining out from this point forward, like what goes into all four of those different categories for me of things that I really should be focusing on as a business owner. Love to hear your thoughts. If you have a way to do this, how do you manage that? How do you effectively look back and say, hey, yeah, I, I effectively used my time and I'm spending most of my time on high value work that's really pushing forward the business. So this is Melody Moore here for Business Tech Ninjas.